Well, hey there, boys and girls. Crafty Carol here with a brand new craft for you. That's right, right here at Cool School. Today's craft is a pretty wild one. It's inspired by one of my favorite books, which was just read by one of my favorite people. That's right, the Jungle Book. You might have guessed it because I'm wearing my super awesome cheetah shirt. So today's craft is a jungle diorama. Okay, I can hear somebody out there saying, okay, Carol, what is a diorama? A diorama is a 3D model, and we're gonna make one today that looks like the jungle. So what do you need to make this craft? One shoe box, I've got it covered in brown construction paper, scissors, glue, blue tissue paper, these little animal figurines, fake plants that I bought at a crafting store, and I've got these styrofoam balls, which I've cut in half, and we're gonna use those to prop up some of our trees. Oh, and stay tuned to the end of this episode because I've got two very special fan shout outs. That's right, you don't wanna miss it. All right, now I'll get started making this craft. So first of all, we've got this box here. It's just a regular shoe box that I covered in some brown construction paper. I'm gonna take the bottom of the shoe, the actual box, and place it like this inside the lid. And that's what our scene's gonna go in here. So, I wanna make the sky. So I'm gonna put some blue paper right in here. I'm using tissue paper just so it has a different sort of texture to it. Alright, you can see right there. I'm gonna glue it in. Just a little of this Mod Podge. Get this all covered in glue. Okay, so I've got glue all in there. I'm just gonna take my paper now. There we go. So you can see all that nice texture in there. So there we go. We're just gonna let that dry for a while. Okay, so let's talk about what we're gonna put inside our diorama. I went out, I bought these animal figures and the artificial plants from a crafting store, but you do not have to do that. What I used to do when I was a kid and I made these dioramas is I'd go through all our old magazines and I would cut out pictures of animals and make a little stand so they stand up and I would put that in my diorama. It was awesome! Don't get stressed out if you don't have all the little figures and the artificial plants from the crafting store. Just wanted to let you know that. This is dry enough for what we're doing here. Let's go ahead and put some green base right there. All right, let's mod podge it up. Put that right in there. All right, so let's go ahead and put some plants in there. Got these green little plants here. I'm gonna cut them up so we can put them all throughout. All right, put some plants. So for now, I just got a few plants. All right, so I like this little bouquet right here. So I'm gonna cut some of the flowers out, make some little jungle plants. And so now I'm just sort of sticking some of the flowers in here just to make it a little more colorful. You can also just sort of drop some of these on the ground. Here is a piece, a little like palm tree thing we're gonna use. I just propped it up so that it looks pretty cool and I like the way it shoots out of the front. It gives it a real, a real 3D element. These are some nice wild little bushes. So I'm just gonna cut a bunch of this and I'm gonna stick it into one of these styrofoam balls. It's looking pretty awesome. Oh my gosh, it looks exactly like a real jungle. So let's add some animals to start with our monkeys here. I think these are actually orangutans. I love them so much, oh my gosh. All right, some more animals that we have in the jungle book are wolves, just howling. They're probably like, ow. We've got one more animal. We've got this adorable little cheetah here. And now since we've got our animals in there, I'm just gonna cut up and add some more leaves for the floor. Okay, let's sprinkle some of these. And I think that we are done. Woo! Look at that! Oh my gosh! Well, there you have it, boys and girls. Our Jungle Book Diorama. Make one yourself. Show us, I wanna see them. Have your mom or dad take a picture and post it to Instagram and tag us so we definitely won't miss it. And you can make any kind of diorama you want. You can make a cool school diorama. Ooh, 
Well, tell me in the comments what you're gonna do. Click right over here to watch Miss Booksy. Click right down there to watch some more crafts. Subscribe, and it's time, drum roll please, for fan shout outs. All right, so first I've got this from Ruby, it's beautiful, I love it Ruby. Check it out, look at that. So Ruby says, my name is Ruby, I am six years old, I love Crafty Carol, yes. Got some beautiful coloring here, oh my goodness. Hello, look at this amazing picture of Crafty Carol, I love it. And then, oh, got some more beautiful coloring here. And the next one is from Noah. All right, Noah wrote me an amazing letter here. It says, Dear Crafty Carol, my name is Noah and I live in California. I'm six years old. It was my birthday yesterday. Happy birthday, Noah! Yay! I like your videos very much. My favorite craft is the star jar. I like when Miss Booksy comes to visit. I do too. We got a lot in common, Noah. Please come for a play date. We'll go to Disneyland. That's amazing. Watch Inside Out do Halloween crafts, Inside Out crafts. I have a rainbow pencil too. And we can also play toys in my room. Love, Noah. And there's a little picture here. This is just amazing. Noah, thank you so much. And thanks for your, your nice letter. We love you too. Cool School loves its fans and we cannot do it without you. So keep all the love coming. All right, bye. Ha, 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 ha.